they're still attacking the uh, zombies down there, so I need to help them out. And there's still a village right there that we haven't even gone to yet, so might want to think about that. Yeah, you know what? Let's try and take down this Horde of the Hunt outpost right there. Make sure we grab the Prismarine before it falls into lava. So let's start heading forward and let's take down another Piglin outpost. All right, we're on the outskirts right now. And I don't... Okay, I've, I see something right there. Yeah, you know what? Let's go down to Creeper. Command him to take down that big old tower right there. Ooh. Oh, jeez, they're launching Piglins at us! Ah! I see... <laughs> at least we have the Creepers heading towards that giant... Is that the Piglin launcher tower? Is that what we'll just... Oh, man, it fell down already! Holy heck, that was amazing! Hold on, do we have any Creepers here? I don't think so, yeah. I uh, might want to get another Creeper Summoner right here, and then just from the outside, just command my Creepers to go into there. And it seems like there's caged up what look like... Are those villagers? I can't tell. Uh, summon in a bunch of Creepers here. I don't know how many... Yeah, you know what? I don't need to have, like, a billion of them. <laughs> just get them all to follow me, and then let's command them all specifically to take down... I guess that. Seems like that's just a Piglin spawner or something there. I guess from the outside, yeah, you know what? I can start getting some of the LAs to start curing some of the nether, because we have so many LAs now, you guys. There we go. Boom. Look at how fast it's getting cured there. Let's see. Now I'm a little bit closer. Let's see where the next building's going to be. Uh, is that it right there? I guess. Oh, right there. <laughs> yeah, it's another spreader right there. Cool. And I think there's another building back there. Oh, another nether spreader back there. Okay, okay. Let's get more LAs to start curing more of the land here. There we go. My gosh, look at all those. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, seems like that's enough. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, whatever that building was, I guess we took it down, so that's great. Oh, man, hold on. Yeah, there's Prismarine. Yeah, let me go grab the Prismarine. Yeah, like I said a minute ago, I, I don't want it to fall into lava, so I grabbed like 10 right there, which is good, but not enough. Let's see, where am I going? Oh, wait, yeah, that's that building's still standing, though. Hold on. Tell the creepers to go there. There we go. Take down that building, and then I'll make sure I grab the Prismarine before it falls into lava. Any Prismarine? Oh, I didn't grab anything there, man. All right, well, it seems like we could rescue some of the villagers right there, but kind of want to get some more creepers to take down that last building. Let's head forward, and then uh, once we destroy the last building, all the villagers are going to be rescued anyway. So is that it? What, what, what is it? Yeah, I guess it's whatever that thing is. So, yeah, it's just another spreader, I think. So, boom. They're all commanded, and yeah, while we're waiting. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. While they're exploding it, let's grab Prismarine. There we go. Outpost destroyed. Got ten more Prismarine there. Awesome. And all the villagers are free. All right, well, at least we got a little bit of Prismarine right there. Only, like, what, 20? But still, that <laughs> helped out a little bit, huh? And recall. I'm curious about that. What does that do? Is that... No mobs available for... Yeah, so I assume if there's any creepers that I summoned in that are just randomly out and about... That'll make them all come back to here, huh? I don't know if there's a reason to get rid of this, so I just keep that there. Yeah, let me start teleporting around all these villages and see if we can get any more Prismarine from their chests. Let me get back to doing that. And if they don't have any uh, scatter towers near their fountain, I'll definitely start building more of them. And let's see what they have for us this time. And more lapis, more coal, more stone, and more wood. Not bad. Let's go check the other villages, though. Oh, that village is, like, still this damaged. Was damaged last night. Lend them a hand if you can. Yeah, let's, let's go help them out a little bit. We got play. Yeah, I'm full on wood, full on stone, full on what looks like iron there, too. So let's help out these guys. They still, they've still got walls built up everywhere, which is good. Yeah, I guess let's get some scatter towers to help them out at the fountain. But everything else, yeah, they're all four corners. Still good to go. Oh, is there yeah, I think their fountain's actually damaged, isn't it? Yeah, it's like really cracked right now. Yeah, it's at 13%, I think it said right there. So let's get a uh, carpentry hut set up, too. And, like we said... Between each gate, let's get two arrow towers to help defend them, right? But at least these guys are going to be nice and protected from now on with all these scatter towers. We got the carpentry hut helping this out. Yeah, they're at 15% right now, so this is going to be great, you guys. By the way, did I check their chest? I don't know if they have a chest available. Yeah, they do. Is there anything in the chest? Let's see. We've got wood stone. Okay. I guess that's just offerings for helping them out a little bit there, right? And it seems like we have some Horde of the Bastion outposts here, so we might want to think about taking that down. Yeah, get some more, uh... Prismarine and even some gold there, but there's also this zombie homestead over here. Might want to help the them out. Zombies are defenseless against the cruelty of the piglins. Please, you must help them. Yeah, let's do that. But first, on the way over there, let's head over to the Horde of the Bastion, try and take that down, try and get more Prismarine. Okay, so yeah, east, it looks like the sun's starting to rise over there, so it seems like nighttime is just now starting to pass, which is great. Let's start heading south this way, start heading towards the next outpost, and I guess we'll get another creeper spawner set up outside of that and do the same strategy I just did to that other outpost, huh? Oh, man! Those mushrooms, like, bounce you up in the sky! Holy heck, might want to think about using those in the future if they're nearby. But speaking of nearby, yep, boom, there's the next piglin base. Let's get a creeper spawner set up. 
I guess, right on the outskirts? Or do we want to start pushing forward and then start building? Oh yeah, it seems like they have a piglin launcher or something here, so... <laughs> there you go. And let's get the creeper spawner set up pretty close by. Like right here. Yeah, there you go. Let's get the creeper spawner right there. Summon in a bunch of creepers once that's done, and then we're going to rescue all those egg and villagers, huh? So here we go. Creepers. Let's get these guys all set to take down, I guess, yeah, that nether spreader right there. Seems like another building over there to start spawning even more creepers. Yeah, there we go. And let's get these creepers to take down that building back there. There we go, my gosh, I love this new strategy, you guys. This is amazing. I'm glad we helped out the creepers and we can just summon them in. Yeah, another uh, piglin outpost right there, but I need to get the prismarine before it... Yeah, there you go. Need to grab the prismarine before it goes into lava or whatever else, right? Yeah, let's grab all that. Even more prismarine right here. And might even rescue some of the villagers, but... Don't really need to do that right now, honestly. Like, they're going to get rescued anyways after the fact. Let's get another round of creepers going all the way over to... Yeah, let's, get, let's go to the uh, piglin spawner. Take down this piglin spawner, we don't have to worry about them. Oh man, I need more coal. Holy heck, I just summoned in. Yeah, I'm like, that makes sense. These are creepers after all, right? So, man, yeah, I, I need to get whatever that was that upgrades the amount of coal I could have. But there's Prismarine over there. Let's go grab that before I lose it all, right? And this fell down. I got gold from that. That's cool. That's cool. And I guess we'll just take down this last uh, nether sprayer thing on my own with the zombies and whatever else over here, huh? Yeah, I need, I need to get some like stone, cobblestone golems or something like that to help out a little bit. Because uh, now that we don't have any creepers, we can't really take these down very fast. But we're at 107 prismarine, which is amazing right now. Get some of these guys in. These cobblestone golems are the next best thing past the uh, creepers. Because we don't have any more stone, unfortunately. But here we go. Start attacking that. And I think there's only one more structure left. And then I think that's it for this outpost, huh? Yeah, wow, look at how cracked this is. It's going down so fast with all those guys, and I don't even have it maxed out. Boom! Prismarine, I'll grab that, and let's go to the next one all the way over there. I'll summon in even more here in just a sec. So if I recall... Wow, yeah, that recalls everything over here, actually. Wow, that's amazing, holy heck! All right, let's head towards this way. And we got a random bit of zombies right there, that's gonna help us out. And start taking down their last structure, whatever this thing is. We even know what that thing is even called? I don't know, but there's lava near it, so let's make sure the prismarine doesn't go into the lava. Wow, look at him! Oh, man, that went down so fast and it just gave us gold there, too. <laughs> Looks like the villagers are free. All right, so now, speaking of uh, rescuing, let's go down to the zombie homestead. The zombies are defenseless against the cruelty of the piglins. Please, you must help them. Yeah, let's go ahead. And uh, you know what? Is there any coal that I can get on the way there? I don't think so, yeah. Yeah, I need to get some more coal. Let's go over. Yeah, here we go. Maybe this village will give us coal. For now, let us hope they avoid the piglins' hungry eyes. Yeah, creepers are going to be absolutely invaluable at defending those zombies over there. So let's make sure we have plenty of coal to spawn them in. Yeah, a lot of uh, coal deposits around here, which is great. And now that the LAs are nice and busy gathering coal, let's go see if there's any coal inside the village chest here. Open it up. Let's see what's inside. Oh, we just got lapis and wood and stone there. So, eh. Doesn't really matter though, because we're full on coal anyways. So from here, let's go back to this village. Here we are, and let's start heading south again. Yeah, we're full on everything except for wood, which we can easily get on the way there, so. Uh, hold on. Where are all my golems at? I don't know where they're all at. I might want to try that recall ability if there's any, uh, summoners here. Yeah, I don't see any summoning things here, so I might just build a, uh, I don't know, let's get a cobblestone golem spawner here. And I guess we'll do the recall thing, because I don't know where they're all at. I must have lost them or something, but. There you go, so recall. There they are. Awesome. Yeah, we got a lot of that. Yeah, you know what? Grindstone golems, mossy golems. We definitely want to have some mossy, though. Always want to have some support. Uh, do we want to get some skeletons, though? What do we need to summon in each skeleton? Does it say? Like, the spawner itself requires diamond, but that's not that big of a deal. I get some plank golems, but yeah, let's get some mossy here. Yeah, there you go. And then on the way there, I suppose we'll... Oh, what in the world? I have a random turtle. <laughs> I have a turtle following me. <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah, look at that. He's helping fight our side. There's another turtle right there. Yeah, you can help us out, too. <laughs> let's head south and let's go rescue the zombies. Oh, I think we're getting close to the zombie outpost or homestead, whatever you want to call it. Look at all these trees around here, you guys. Man, I'm basically full on wood, but if I ever needed any, this is the place to come, huh? And there's another skeleton right there. Yeah, I definitely want to wrangle up as many of these random stragglers as we can because we're maxed out on the summoned golems right now. And I think if we look at the map, uh, yeah, we're like basically are already, so... Let's head in and let's rescue these zombies. Are they, are they in the middle of all this? Oh, here we go. We got the cutscene. Yeah. Oh, jeez. 
zombies are overrun. They fought bravely to help you, but they don't know how to handle such an attack. Don't worry, we'll help you guys out, just as you helped us. Oh, they're putting the cages too. Ah, uh, yeah, let's definitely free them and then they can help fight by our side. Oh, jeez. What's that big thing back there? How am I going to take that down? I might need creepers for that. Oh my gosh. Oh, these guys are like poisoned or something. Whoopsie daisy. Uh, so we need to take down 71 of these piglins here, it seems. So uh, let's try and defend as much as we can and maybe set up some arrow tower spawners, etc. Because I've got plenty of resources to do so. So let's get, a, uh, let's get an arrow tower. Actually, you know what? Let's get scatter tower. We haven't used those yet. So let's get two scatter towers. Let's get an arrow tower in there too. Even get a uh, extendable wall. Help defend them against any critters. Oh my gosh, immediately just... Holy heck, whatever those guys are throwing. Took down my uh, arrow tower before it even finished. Yeah, holy heck. This is insane, you guys. But at least the scatter tower is going to help out a little bit. But man, we're getting overrun like crazy here. I need to get some mossy golems or something. Jeez, they already took down that golly. So we take down a bunch of piglins. Man, I died. Holy heck, that's the first time we died, I think. Man. So I need to go back there on foot or what? What, what happens? I don't know how many- I oh! We're all the way back here, I've been respawned I guess at the nearest village or something. <laughs> Jeez! Anything inside the chest I can get though? Uh, we got wood and stone, okay, cool. Uh, but I need to get plenty of mossy. Yeah, you know what, let's recall all of our golem back here. <laughs> yeah, let's try and rescue him, but... Man, yeah, I need to go back there on foot again! Might want to think about getting a creeper summoner when if we get there, so we can actually take down big groups of, uh, enemies. Cause there's a ton of them in there! I think I see one of Knowledge's old power towers over there. Yeah, there's like a giant bell tower over here. I just noticed that. Holy heck. I don't know if you guys caught that right there. I, I barely just started recording in time, but let's investigate it. What is this? The villagers once used these towers to call to the LAs for assistance. When that bell rings, it makes the sweetest sound you'll ever hear. We might need them because all these piglins attacking the zombies. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> apparently we don't share the same taste in music. <laughs> Not everybody agrees with you. Cool, so we could build one of these towers and it stuns a bunch of nearby enemies. Can I actually get a laze to a... Oh yeah, I need to power tower improvement still. Man! Alright, we'll worry about that a little bit later, like that lightning tower and the stun tower too. Uh, we'll worry about that when the time comes, but for right now, let's keep heading towards the zombie homestead. Oh, I think we're here. Yep, this is it. Oh jeez, we're getting poisoned. Golly, that probably yeah, that probably weakened us tremendously early on, right? But right here, speaking of stun, let's get some uh, grindstone golems. Uh, you know what? Yeah, let's get some creeper golem or creep <laughs> creep golems. Let's get some creepers as well. But I, I can't really use them right now, unfortunately. So let's just head straight up. Maybe uh, we'll go in like arrow towers back there too. But for right now, let's just take down as many of these piglins as possible. Because as long as we kill 51, we should be good to reverse the attack on their actual base, right? Oh my gosh, what is that thing? There's like flat, like a giant flower right there or something. I don't know what that is, but I definitely want to try and rescue these zombies if I can. Ah oh man, there's so many piglin though. I need to get healed up by the mossy golems, but they're not healing me unfortunately. No, I'm gonna die again. Why are the mossy golems not helping me? Ah oh man, let's let's go back here. Oof. And let's uh let's recall all of my golems back here. Let's build a couple arrow towers over here as well. Maybe a scatter tower too. All right. Oh my gosh. Whatever those giant things are. Man, I need to summon in some creeper. Oh man, they took. They're taking down everything. I, I don't even have a base to settle down in, you guys. This is crazy. I'm going to go and try and take down as many of these piglins as I can, but there's like no number I need to start working to. Oh, here we go. 13, 12 more. Okay, okay. So we're almost good in that regard. Just need to keep taking down the small little easy piglins. Then we'll worry about the big ones a little bit later when I can summon in some creepers, right? But seven more. Oh, six more, four more. Three more. Come on, come on, come on, two more. And then the zombies should be freed. Here we go, okay. Ooh, oh my gosh, thankfully I didn't die again. There we go, the zombies are free. Now they can help us out. Yeah, you better be running. <laughs> but now I'm almost dead. I'm almost dead immediately. The zombies were eager to rejoin the fight. Now you can stop the piglins together. Yeah, as long as there's giant whatever is over there, don't do damage to me from afar and take down any structure I have from afar. Jeez, just like that. I have no way of just settling down. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What are these? All oh, these are plant golems. Hold on. I need to get some mossy golems. They take down every one of my structures, unfortunately. 
Then you get a creeper spawner, but I need to place it all the way back there, and then I can do some amazing damage with all the coal and whatever else I have in my inventory. Here we go, here we go. Okay, let's grab a bunch of creepers, and then we'll aim down those giant guys from afar. I don't know how many I might need, but I kind of want to get just a bunch of creepers in general. Okay, here we go, here we go. Let's go over to creepers, and then you guys aim down whatever that thing is. Kill him. Man, look at him scuttling in. They're going to explode and hopefully kill those guys. Are they going to do it? Or are they going to get killed? Oh! Oh, they get the one in the background, but... They kill it? I think they did! Okay, good, good, good. Let's get another round of creepers going. That's going to take up, like, all my coal, unfortunately. As long as that other one doesn't come over here and kill me. But there you go. I don't know how many I just summoned in, but hopefully this is going to be enough to take him down. Here we go. Take him down. Go, 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 go. You guys are commanded. Oh my gosh, you're taking down my arrow tower. But the creepers are about to take him down. Oh, they're going to explode. Oh, they got him. They got him. My gosh, I didn't even see any explosions, but we still got him. Oh my gosh. Now we can start pushing forward and defending even more of this area here. This is good. This is good. Uh, yeah, I've got like no golems at all. I just have a couple mossy and that's it. Let's summon in a bunch of these guys here. Or, yeah, we've only got two mossy and one grindstone, so let's get some uh, arrows. There we go. Get some of them. And you know what? Let's get some, yeah, cobblestone golems too. Summon in these guys. But now we can actually start pushing forward towards their base. Uh oh, dust. The piglins are starting to invade the uh, villages. Whoops. But there you go. Let's get a bunch of these guys here. There we go. Now we can start heading forward. Maybe build some arrow towers and whatnot to help defend these uh, smaller structures, like so. So there you go, scatter tower there. Maybe build an arrow tower back here too. There you go, if I can actually survive long enough. I don't know if I can. I don't know if there's any more of those giant guys back there that are going to try and destroy my buildings. So uh, what is that big plant over there? I don't know. I don't know what that thing is that's like spraying a bunch of something. I don't know what that is, but at least we're doing damage to whatever this is. I don't know. Is everyone attacking that big flower there? It looks like it. <laughs> Let me try and swipe down these uh, piglin back here, though. Oh, is this? Oh, man, their base is all the way over there. They've got so many blaze towers and stuff, too. It's crazy, but maybe from here. Oh, gosh, we've got a lot of piglin over here, too. Holy heck. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Push forward here, guys. Let's get an arrow tower back here. Maybe another one back here. There you go. That way we have somewhere to come back to and retreat to, right? All right, so we're right on the edge of their base here. Uh, man, is this getting damaged? I don't think it is. Yeah, I think we're still good. Yeah, okay. Uh, but I might want to start building some towers, like, right at the base of this. Yeah, there's a bunch right here, so... You know what? Let's get a scatter tower, like, right here. Maybe another one there. Maybe get an arrow tower back here, too. There we go. Man, they took down that scatter tower while I was still building. Golly, if they did, that sucks. <laughs> All right, yeah, you know what? Let's get a carpenter. Should I get a carpenter hut here? Because that requires a bunch of materials. 150, 150. Yeah, let's do that. Let's put a carpenter hut there. That'll help out tremendously. Let's get another set of arrow towers here. There you go. Start pushing towards their base. Yeah, they got uh, blaze towers like right there. So let's get the allays to actually start curing some of the netherrack here. I've got tons of allays, so we can start curing this instantly. <laughs> Man, look at how fast they're just getting pushed back. That's awesome. Holy, okay, yeah, definitely want to start setting up a, a mini base here, honestly. Yeah, so let's start getting some, uh, let's get another mossy golem spawner. Let's get another, yeah, you know what, let's get, let's get some skeletons. Let's get some skeletons. And, yeah, I definitely want to get some grindstone. Not too many of them, but a few of them. Let's actually recall all of our golems back here. There you go, yeah, we had tons right there. Let's get some, yeah, let's get some skeletons. Not too many, but there you go, that should be good. Let's start pushing forward here. There we go, everyone, charge forward. And then we'll start working towards that uh, blaze tower if I can. Maybe I'll summon in a bunch of, uh, not zombies, but creepers. <laughs> yeah, all these guys are just standing around. What are they doing? Take down the blaze tower. Right there, that one right there. And I'll take care of all the piglins at the bottom. I don't know, can they actually go up there? Because it's kind of on top of like a, a bit of a hill there, you know? Yeah, I don't think any of my golems are able to go up that because it's like a big cliff and I don't think they're able to jump or anything. So this kind of sucks here. I don't know if I'm able to push forward that much, but uh, maybe I'll get my allays to start curing some of the netherrack. Yeah, now that we have nine of each allay, we can get so much work done so quickly, you guys. This is insane. All right, so this is all cured here. They're, they're getting shot at by my arrow tower, but I don't think any of my uh, golems are actually taking these down, unfortunately. I might need to build a ramp, so I haven't had to do with this in a while, so let's see. There we go. All right, let's build a ramp, and now my golems should hopefully be able to go up there, right? So let's actually recall all my golems. See if we can get more cobblestone golems, then we'll head into there. Oh, they're starting to take down my arrow tower, so everyone, here, gather in, gather in. Let's take down that blaze tower right there. There you go. Don't go, oh, man, they're going the wrong way. They're not even going on the ramp. <laughs> Come there, God. I'm going to have to command him a little bit better so he can actually take that down. But... Okay, here we go. Recall them back here. They're all following, they're all following. And then now, 
let's command them to the blaze tower right there there we go oh no they're still going on the side they're getting distracted by the piglins on the outside Okay, okay, are they going to follow me over to here? Okay, okay, so there we go. Now we took down the blaze tower. Okay, that's good. So we can build another ramp from here up to there. There we go, there we go. Hopefully we can. I don't know if I can, but I'll try. And then we'll get them all to target down the next blaze tower. Then after that, it seems like it's just smooth sailing straight to the nether portal, huh? Okay, maybe I'll get the uh, Alays to start curing more of the netherrack around here. There you go, so we can start pushing forward with more arrow towers and scatter towers and whatnot. But man, there's so many piglet here. Oh my gosh. This tower is getting really cracked though, it looks. And then I'll build another ramp once that goes down. There we go, it fell, it fell. Take down all the piglins and let's build the final ramp we need because it's right there is the nether portal. Let's see, let's build it, build it, build it. Not too big. Okay, I got it, I got it. Okay, good, good, good. <laughs> Maybe get some creepers next. Holy heck. Look at all these piglin here. I've got a little bit of coal. I don't know if we're actually able to get too many creepers, but this will still help out a lot. I know that. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Let's actually recall everyone so we don't lose everyone at once, right? There you go. And then I'll spawn in a few creepers here. Okay, there you go. There you go. Okay, let's go in. Oh my gosh, look at all the piglin there. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we need to, we need to kill these piglin first. Let me see if I can get the creepers to actually head straight for the nether portal. There you go. I just commanded the creepers. I don't know if they're actually going to take that command or not. They might have fallen off the ramps. All right, got rid of all three of those ramps right there. So I can hopefully rebuild them a little bit better, you know? All right, so we got a ramp here. Let's see if we can build another one that goes right there. Okay, that's a little bit better. That's a little bit better. It's like basically one giant ramp now, so that's great. So we can start curing some of the netherrack here. Yeah, I'm curing some of the netherrack down here, so I'm starting to creep forward here, you guys. This is great. Let's see if I can rescue some of the zombies. Can I rescue these zombies? Open up the cage, open up the cage. And there you go, everyone. Start heading straight towards another portal. I'm commanding everyone, including the zombies. <laughs> See if we can rescue more zombies. Let's get rid of these piglins here. We can rescue them. Come on, come on. Oh, I can't. Oh man, another portal's already down five percent. That's good. That's good. But kind of want to get some creepers. Honestly, I'll help it out a lot more. All right, let's see if we can start opening up this cage here. Man, I got shot. Oh, there's a blaze tower back there shooting at me. But here we go. The cage is open. Awesome. Okay, okay. Let's get all these guys to come in and start attacking them. The nether portal. Let's go up there and help them out because there's a lot. I see a lot of piglin there. <laughs> oh my gosh. We don't have any creepers helping up here. It's just nothing but zombies that I freed and a few uh, stone golems, too. Jeez. <laughs> Man, I've swiped through so many of these piglin here. How? This is crazy. <laughs> All right, got more zombies heading towards the portal. Only two. Oh, jeez. 2% left. It's about to go down. It went down. The zombies have been defended. Man, that was a lot of work to take them down, but we did it in the end, you guys. Let's grab all the prismarine before it goes into lava. <laughs> Man, that was really good. Let's grab Man, there's even more over here. Don't mind if I do. Oh, cutscene. Oh, now the zombies are building the flame tribute over here, too. So now we're friends with creepers, skeletons, and zombies. We can spawn them all in. I wonder if we can get Endermen and stuff. The flame has been lit. You've earned their trust. The zombies will fight with you wherever, whenever. Awesome. Okay, so how many can I hold? Yeah, so at the bottom right corner, you can see, yeah, 28 right now. So that number went up. How much? Extra 10 or something like that. Man, look at all the 207 Prismarine. This is amazing. We're able to get the plus four uh, flames of whatever it's called. <laughs> so I'm able to summon in 24 instead of just 20. Or I can save up until I have 400 Prismarine and we could have plus 10 flames of whatever it's called. Yeah, right now I have 38 mobs following me. Most of them are zombies that I rescue. That's awesome. All right, let's see if there's any villages that need to be uh, rescued or anything like that. Oh, this village chest is full. Let's go check this. Oh man, look at all the zombies that teleported with me. Oh my gosh. Anything good? And we got, nah, we just got, <laughs> we just got diamonds and 1100 stone and a thousand wood. Man. <laughs> I want to see if there's any here that have any prismarine though. Because we've gotten prismarine from these villages before. Anything good here? Uh, coal, 100 coal. Don't mind if I do. That's actually great. Now I can get more creepers. I want to go back to whatever that village was that I got a bunch of coal out a minute ago. This village chest is full too. <laughs> Basically every village chest is full. Oh yeah, not every village has the, uh, oh wow, this one's not even protected at all. Holy heck. Let's get some scatter towers to at least protect, if, if we don't have a bunch of walls around the uh, village, at least get some scatter towers to help out protect the fountain itself, right? 
Uh, let's check their chest while all those are building. Oh yeah, this is the first village that we saved, huh? Yeah, there's the carpenter thing right there. Cool. But yeah, we're, we're full on wood and stone and diamonds and lapis. Man, I'm maxed out at 400 lapis right now. Iron down there. I can get a little bit more iron. I guess I'll grab that. But I need to go back to wherever that was to get some more coal. Where was that? Oh yeah, I was up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's go here. And this village may have some coal inside of their chest. It's not full, but they may have some inside. <laughs> Look at all those zombies. That's crazy. Anything good? Uh, whatever it was, I hit the carry limit for it, so it was probably wood or stone or diamonds or lapis or whatever, but let's go around the perimeter here and gather even more coal so we can get more creepers and maybe we'll take down another horde of the hunt nether portal, huh? Alright, I'm maxed out at 150 coal, so let's start heading towards the horde of the hunt. Here's one of their old bases. I guess I can get the LAs to start cleaning this up a little bit, huh? There we go. Oh my gosh, look at, look at that! We have nine LAs that we can do this with. This goes by instantly. I have all these zombies, but I have only nine summoned in golems, so I can summon in a bunch. Either golems or creepers, which I'll probably do creepers next, honestly. Oh, and there's another one of those, like, power tower things right there. I don't think we have enough. Do we have enough prismarine to do that improvement? We might. Uh, I guess, like, yeah, you know what? It's one of those question mark things. I'm heading the wrong direction anyways. Let's go see what this power tower is. Isn't this that lightning rod? It looks just like that lightning rod tower that we saw. Might be another one of those, right? Yeah, blast tower. That's what it's called. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. So now we know that's there, but I need to head over there. I'm heading the wrong direction, golly. But hey, at least we're recruiting up more of these friends here, right? Yeah, it seems like we maxed out at 40. You can see there it says 40 on the bottom right corner. So once we get to the Horde of the Hunt, I'm going to send all these zombies in and they're going to take down all their stretchers so fast. It's going to be amazing. Oh, I think the Horde of the Hunt is right above this hill right here. Are they right? Oh, whoa, whoa. There's a big chest. Whoa. Open up the chest. What's inside? A lay chest. The LA's are eager to help. <gasps> They'll fill these chests with things that will aid you in battle. Okay, cool. So we got 84 Prismarine right there. That was amazing. Where did, we saw another one of those chests not too long ago. Actually, I think it was episode one, wasn't it? Oh, man, where did that go? I don't know where it is, but kind of want to check up on it and see if there's any more uh, loot inside of that. But yeah, now we're at 291. That's awesome. And we're going to start taking down this next... Yeah, yeah, this is a pretty good angle. We're going to start taking down this next Horde of the Hunt area, and we're going to get even more Prismarine by taking down their buildings. This is going to be great, but... There's some creepers I could recruit, but I've got so many zombies already, I'm maxed out. Oh, there they are back there. Okay. We might want to- Oh, jeez! Uh-oh, uh-oh. Ah, oh, they started exploding some of my zombies already! Jeez. Well, at least that kind of kills them, though, so that's good, but... There's a random straggler piglin right here, let's try and take them down. Man, they're getting overrun by the zombies! Jeez, I don't even know what the zombies are doing, just poking at them or something. <laughs> Remember to build those spawners. The piglin forces here are quite impressive. Sometimes bravery alone cannot overcome. Gather more friends, gather more tools, and you'll be ready for this challenge in no time. Really? They think I can't take it on? I'm like, they might be right, but I'm already in here too. This is going crazy. Yeah, so might want to build. Yeah, you know what? Let's get the creeper spawner here. Let's get some towers to help defend all this area back here. Some uh, scatter towers as well. Oh, I can see a bunch of piglins heading my way already. So maybe I'll get these guys to start take it down. Where, where are their structures at? I don't see any structures except for all the way back there. I'm like, yeah, th this is the Horde of the Hunt, right? So they don't have any walls or anything defensive like that. Except for Blaze Towers I see back there. Those those are going to help them out tremendously. But other than that, yeah, I, I don't think there's anything else. I'm going to start pushing forward with the uh, the Allays curing the Netherrack and whatnot. See if I can do that. Yeah, I definitely want to do that right there, especially. And I can start putting down more Arrow Towers, right? Yeah, all those zombies are just taking down these Piglin Turtle guys, which is good, but let me go back here. Oh no, what are you- what's that? Guys, stop following me, stop following me. Take down the Piglin Turtle guy. There you go. Okay, good, good, good. <laughs> Spawn in some uh, creepers next. There you go. And he's getting shot at by our scattered towers, but it's shooting him in the, the shell right there, though, so I don't know about that. Let's see if we can use these creepers here to take down- yeah, you know what? Take, take that guy down, specifically. Take him down. Creepers, go ahead. There you go. Oh no! That guy's going to drop some bombs! Golly. Put the creepers in the background. Did they take that? Oh, they did! They took down the shell guy back down. I'll try and zoom it in for you guys. To oh wait, no they didn't! Did they? They didn't! Oh my gosh! That's insane! You have one focus down the shell guy right there, because holy heck, he has so much heck in health, it's insane. Man, my creepers already exploded back here against all the regular piglin instead of the shell guy. Golly. Might build more uh, structures here to start creeping forward on him, you know? Oh, nice! The shell guy went down right there, great! And they got more over there, and yeah, I built more uh, arrow towers, scatter towers, etc. right there, so... I don't know about Knowledge, I'm like, his name is literally Knowledge, but... 
I might be able to start creeping towards this nether portal here, you guys, even though they said I wasn't prepared. Yeah, you know what? I need to get some, uh, some support. So let's get some mossy golems. There we go. Maybe get some... Yeah, let's get some cobblestone golems so we can start taking down some structures without relying fully on the creepers, right? Let's start getting some of these guys. Let's actually recall everyone over here. Does that recall the zombies, too? No, it doesn't. Okay, it's only the golems that it recalls. So let's get the uh, cobblestone guys here as well. And yeah, let's get some plank golems, too. Because I don't have any uh, range here. It's nothing but zombies and stuff. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's get everyone to start pushing forward, and hopefully the mossy golems can help out all the zombies that are here. Oh my gosh! There's so many of them! Jeez! And I'm going to stay back here and get my lays to start curing more than netherrack. Oh, another hog's on right there. Start curing more than netherrack, and we start push forward with more uh, structures with the arrow towers, scatter towers, etc. That'd be great. Let's actually start with the scatter towers. That might help out a bit more. Start with the scatter towers there, and get an arrow tower like back here. And get another one right there. Oh my gosh! Look at all these. There's so many zombies! <laughs> Holy heck! Might be able to take down that uh, blaze tower all the way back there, but... Man, I need I need everyone to group together because we're spread pretty thin right now, honestly. Yeah, here we go. We got all these zombies over here. I need everyone to stick together, especially the mossy golems helping out our uh, healing, right? Oh my gosh, there's so much going on on screen right now! It's crazy! We're getting attacked by so many angles, but I've got so many zombies and arrow towers and stuff. It's amazing! Oh, here we go. We got some sort of structure right here. Let's take it down. Boom, man, they took that down so fast. That was crazy. Oh, we got a uh, Ninja Turtle guy right here. Hold on. Let's see if everyone can take him down. But everyone's all the way over here. Let me get him. Everyone all grouped together. Away from the lava. <laughs> here he is. Here he is. Here he is. Aim him down, everyone. Aim him down. <laughs> Jeez, he's going to get insect. Well, he's rolling through everyone, unfortunately. But I'll try and swipe him down as much as I can with the Diamond Sword. And we get the Scatter Tower there and everything. They take him down. Oh my gosh, they actually killed him. They killed the, the piglin turtle guy. Awesome. <laughs> Might build a carpentry uh, hut right here so we can actually repair everything, but let's build even more arrow towers, more scatter towers, etc. Uh oh, yeah, dust. The piglins are invading. I think most of our uh, villages are nice and protected right now, but I'll check in a minute, see if any of them are under attack that aren't protected. Oh my gosh, there's so many piglin. We're actually going to start getting overrun here pretty soon. <sighs> Man, I've got so many towers and the carpentry hut and whatnot. Uh, you'd think we wouldn't have trouble, but if we are, so we can aim down whatever that structure is. We we'll start pushing towards them a little bit. There's another portal's all the way back there, you know. And I'll try and defend these guys from the back. Okay, that's down. That's good. We got some prismarine. We're at 301, which is amazing. Oh man, if we can push forward a little bit more, that'd be great. But let's see if we can get these alays to start curing up the netherrack. See if we can protect them long enough to not get killed by the piglins, hoglins, etc. Oh my gosh, we got a ninja turtle guy right here. Everyone needs to aim him down. Golly, but there's so many piglins and whatnot around here. I can't, I can't get everyone to aim them down, unfortunately. Oh my gosh, there's just way too much over here. Even though I've got arrow towers and whatnot going, uh, I don't, I don't think we're going to be able to do it. But I'll, I'm trying my best, and there's even the, the ninja, ninja hog right there. I'm trying my best, but we're getting overrun. We're trying to push forward way too much here, I think. I'm trying to get these guys to all follow me. And we can all group together, stay together, and hopefully get healed up by those mossy golems. Yeah, there's just many hordes of, of piglins here, and it's nighttime too, so it's not really the best time to do it, honestly. Ah, they took down one of my arrow towers, it looks like, right there. Golly. So if we can retreat a little bit, try and get more uh, golems. All right, got more golems right now. I don't know how their portal has 1% missing. That's crazy. <laughs> Let's see if I can actually command all these guys to... Take down that blaze tower right there. That'd be really good. We'll make some amazing progress if so. And back here, I'll try and swipe down all the piglins and hoglins while they're busy taking down the blaze tower back there. Oh, they took it down. Amazing. Oh my gosh. We're going to try and get some alays to start pushing forward here. All right, I'm going to try and get all these guys together to take on whatever that thing is. Because I think that's launching piglins at us, right? That big piglin launcher, whatever that thing is. I think that's what that's doing. I might be trying to get some more uh, creepers as well, but a lot of hoggling here, honestly. Grouped together, making it really good for my diamond sword, but man, I'm soaking up a lot of damage. Are they going to be able to take that structure down? They're trying. They're definitely trying their best to take it down. <laughs> it's, it's getting cracked a little bit, but I don't know if it's actually going to get destroyed because it's kind of on a hill. I might have to build a ramp like it did in the uh, zombie area. <laughs> I think it is safe to say you have the horde's attention. Oh, you're right. I took down one of their uh, piglin launchers. <laughs> That's really good there, you guys. Let's try and push forward with some more of this. There you go. That's good. Probably should have done that first, honestly. <laughs> oh, they're starting to take down some of my towers, so let's come back and defend. Come back and defend. I don't know how that piglin even got up there, but... <laughs> oh my gosh, we're all fighting on top of this hill right here. Jeez. 
I don't know if I want to build any more arrow towers, scatter towers just yet until I get, get even more of these guys taken down. But man, at least we took down a lot of their blaze towers, nether spreaders, whatever that piglin launcher building was a minute ago. That's great progress there at least, huh? Well, let's get the blaze to at least start taking down some more of their netherrack. Okay, maybe now I can build a tower on top of this hill. Yeah, here we go. That'll be a really good position. And yeah, they're still launching piglin at us. I don't know if they have another piglin launcher. I think that's it back there. Yeah, I think that's what that is. But man, yeah, they're taking down my arrow towers before they can even finish. I'm gonna have to defend them. Let's get the LAs to keep pushing forward on the nether. But man, yeah, the high ground right there is an amazing spot to put some arrow towers. The piglins target your allies once more. Go to their homestead and prepare for an attack. Man, yeah, I just died right there. Golly. <laughs> we did a pretty good effort right there, though, you guys. I'll admit that. All right, so that's where we respawned, and that's where we were a minute ago. So, yeah, I don't know about going back there. Might go back, to, I don't know, to the Skeleton Homestead, try and recruit some skeletons. That'd be really good. Oh, so what village is under attack? Oh, the creepers are under attack, it looks like. Ooh. The piglins target your friend's home tonight. They will need your help. You've made a powerful ally in the creepers. They'll help you knock down piglin walls with ease. Yeah, so if we go over there and defend the creepers, maybe we could recruit a bunch of them to help take down the Horde of the Hunt. Oh man, another gold chest. Let's open it up. Let's see what's inside. Hopefully more prismarine. What do we get? One gather lay. What? So that mean we have 10? I think so. Yeah, they're currently gathering some stuff right now. So whenever they're all done gathering stone and whatnot, I guess we'll see how many we have in total. Oh, perfect. We got the coal right there. Yeah, we need that to get more creepers. And speaking of such, let's go see if we can actually rescue those creepers that are still under attack. I assume they're still under attack, even though it's daytime right now. And you know what? While I'm in the area, I might build a well of whatever it's called, because I don't have any teleports that are even close to this area, like maybe between the creeper and the uh, skeleton homestead. So if I ever want to recruit either of them, it'll be easy for me to just teleport over here and grab them and just teleport back to wherever, right? But it seems like... Is this it? Yeah, th this is it over here. Seems like a lot of their structures are damaged. Or are they? Yeah, look at that. I still have this. You are just in time. Help your friends prepare defenses for the coming attack. Was it at night? I guess it's at night. Okay. So I'm like, oh, I'll try my best, but it's just turned to daytime here. So like I said, maybe I'll build that well between here and wherever the skeletons are. So where would that be? Yeah, okay. I just need to keep heading this way a little bit more and then meet the halfway-ish point. And that'll be a great spot to build a, a well thing. That way I'm equidistant from either one, whether I want skeletons or creepers, right? A little bit more. Maybe like right there. Yeah, like right there. That might be a good spot. So can I even build that? Do I have the right resources for that? Or well house? That's what it's called. It's 50 prismarine, but honestly, if I'm ever going to build one, this is probably a really good spot to build one. So, oh wait, no, this will work. There we go. Okay, so we're between... <laughs> Look, it's, <laughs> it's still just kind of floating there, but at least it gets the job done, right? But yeah, we're between the creepers and the skeletons. So that's good. While I'm here, though, might want to get some more creepers, and it's the daytime, so hopefully it's going to be a little bit easier for us to push forward towards the uh, Horde of the Hunt. So if we successfully take them down, yeah, I'm definitely going to come back here and defend the creepers at night. Are there even any creepers here? I don't see any. Like, except for the ones that are just randomly spawned uh, wherever. I don't see any at all. All, all their buildings are, like, really cracked, and it looks like they could just fall down at any moment, so I don't know. Like, we got a pretty good amount of creepers on me right now. I've got full uh, coal, too, so we might be fine for right now. At least go back to the Horde of the Hunt and start pushing forward again over there, you know? Is that well house done? Yes, it is. So I could teleport over there if I wanted to, so. Yeah, from here, all I need to do is basically, like, here. Or, like, here. Because I know that's where we have all of our buildings set up, right? So let's just head to that marker, then start pushing forward again. And now it's daytime. It should be a little bit easier, right? Let's actually get everyone to aim down. Oh my gosh, we got one of these explosive guys, though. So we're going to take down our buildings. But man, we take down this turtle guy if we can, because we got a lot of creepers that just exploded right there. Man, I'm going to die again if I'm not careful. <laughs> everyone go in. There we go. Everyone go in right there. Let's see if we build any more uh, spawners over here. So next to that carpentry hut, that's going to be a great place to build all of the golem spawners again. So let's get all them. Then up here, let's definitely get more uh, towers so we can push forward a little bit better. Maybe head towards the nether portal next round. Oh man, it just turned to nighttime, so I need to go help out the creepers here in just a second. Yeah, we're not pushing forward that much at all here. We're getting overwhelmed like crazy, you guys, especially because of those ninja turtle piglins. <laughs> Man, I'm taking out a lot of their piglin spawners on the outskirts, though, so I'm slowly creeping in. So this is great. We're making amazing progress, and of course, using the uh, LAs to start cleaning up all the netherrack around here, too. And if we start taking down more of these towers, that's going to be great for making a bigger push towards the nether portal. Oh, another blaze tower down. Awesome. Okay. Holy heck. I'm down like five golems right now, but 
Man, look at all this netherrack around here that's getting cured. There's so much regular grass around here now, you guys. This is awesome. Oh my gosh. I've got a bunch of uh, cobblestone uh, golems taking down all these treasures around here. And of course, a laze starting to cure some of the netherrack. This is crazy, you guys. I'm like right next to the nether portal. If I can get all this area cleared, oh my gosh, they took down that right there. That's amazing. So we can take down this because it seems like it's, yeah, it's, it's kind of like one of their scatter towers or something like that. But man, if, if all my cobblestone golems can start aiming down all these like defensive stretchers around the nether portal, we might be able to do just one more push towards the nether portal and take it down. Yeah, not yet. All, all the golems just died right there and I'm, I'm starting to get kind of low myself. <laughs> so we can get out of here. Man, ah oh, man, I'll get trapped in the lava. I got the back. I'm building a few arrow towers at the top of this hill because all those hoglins are just stuck at the bottom. They can't go up this uh this steep hill right here, so they, it might be a little bit of a meat grinder for them. Like I said, a pork chop grinder. Because <laughs> there's so many pigments are just down there stuck. And I might be able to spawn in some more uh, golems right here, which is good. So I can spawn in more uh Oh gosh, well they're starting to climb up here, unfortunately, so need to start getting some golems to help defend these. Swimming in. I can't play the loot and uh, defend at the same time. <laughs> There we go, okay. All right, so I've got a bunch right here, and there's so many hoglins and stuff here. I don't know if they're going to be able to go straight towards the nether portal and take it down, but I'll try. I'll, I'll try and command them, but man, they're going to get stuck on the second terrain. Yeah, they're starting to damage it, which is good. Oh my gosh, but there's so many piglins and hoglins behind us. <laughs> I should probably build some arrow towers to help defend it, but it's starting to take some damage here, which is great. Down to 95%. Just need to kill all these piglins and hoglins here. So I've still got all these golems alive. 20 out of 20. Oh man, a ninja turtle guy just spawned in right here. I guess we'll try and ignore him as much as we can. Let's just keep aiming down the nether portal. <laughs> I'll keep trying to swipe down the hoglins and piglins, but man, that ninja turtle is probably going to start taking down our golems. Man, I got it down to 64% before I started getting really low health and I had to retreat a little bit, but that that's a pretty good position right there with the arrow towers and whatnot, but unfortunately I'm pretty low on materials. I can't really build any more arrow towers right now. All right, they're working on the nether portal again. Oh my gosh, there's so many piglins and hoglins back here though, but if we can do another like 30% damage, 40% damage like we did a minute ago, this will be down in no time. <laughs> Oh, it's down to 41%. One more push and the portal will fall. Yes, let's just keep going, let's keep going. We still have a lot of uh, golems here. Oh no, the ninja turtle came back. Man, ah, it's down to 35% though. Oh, never mind, never mind. I'm down to one and a half hearts again. Let's retreat again, let's retreat again. Oh man, they took down my towers here. That's probably, yeah. I have to build another one over here, but man, we made some great progress. It's only down to 25% health now. <laughs> That's really good, you guys. But yeah, let's retreat a little bit, gather more wood, gather more stone, etc. And then we can build more structures and keep pushing on and get that last 25%. Oh wait, hold on. There's a gold chest right here. What's inside of it? More prismarine? If so, that's going to be amazing. Let's see. What's inside? What do we get? 91 iron. Eh, I can't complain about that, I guess. <laughs> All right, here we go. Last push towards another portal. Go, golems, go. Oh my gosh. This might be it. It's down to 23% already. Already lost a couple percent. <laughs> And we already have a bunch of piglins spawned in, heading towards us. Let's get it down. Oh no, another explodey guy. Man, it's down to 20%, 18%. This might be it, this might be it. As long as we won't get overrun or get a ninja turtle, hoglin, piglin guy. <laughs> I think we have it, you guys, 15% left. Holy heck, this will be amazing. I'll probably have to edit like an insane amount of footage together into like one episode of us taking down this one horde of the hunt base, but this portal has got less than 10% left. Still only a few Oglins back here defending 7%. I've still got full health myself. And we still have, I think we have a few uh, mossy golems helping us out and you know, healing up our golems inside there or taking damage. But only 4% left, 3%. Nether portal's about to go down. The Horde of the Hunt will only have one nether portal after this. And there we go, we got it. Oh my gosh, another nether portal down. We're gonna get so much prismarine from that too, right? Uh-oh, the Hoglin Riders aren't happy. Oh, one of the little piglins is talking to the Elder. Oh! What was that? He's telling him to come back here. 
Uh oh, he's running away. <laughs> Looks like you've lost control of your army. <laughs> what else? knows you are besting their horde. That only makes you a more appealing target. Oh my gosh, I'm full on Prismarine 431. I, I, I can't pick up this Prismarine over here. Ah, oh man. Let's go home. Let's actually teleport to the well, whatever it's called. Well of Fate. Let's teleport there. Let's actually spend these and then come back and actually grab the Prismarine that's still on the ground. <laughs> if Hopefully it doesn't despawn, right? But uh, now we can actually get the upgrades that I've been working towards for a while. Huh? Yeah, here you go. Large Flames of Creation. Oh, I need more stone. Hold on. Let's go get some more stone. I need 400 stone. But for once, we actually have plenty of Prismarine. Oh wow, look at this, there's like big pillars of stone right here. Let's get all of our lays to start mining all this up. <laughs> yeah, plus 800 some stone there. Yeah, this is going to be plenty. All right, so which one was that? Large Flames of Creation, yes. So let's place that, I guess we'll place it down there. There you go. Let's place it, uh, I don't know where it is. Where should I even, oh wow, this is actually a physically big stretcher. Hold on, do we have, okay, here we go. We have room here. Yep, so let's place it down over here. Awesome. So now we can actually have. The best offense is a good offense. Yeah, so now we can actually have, what, 30 uh, summoned golems, flames of creation, whatever they're called. So now that that's getting built, uh, let's actually teleport back to, I guess, yeah, let's teleport back to this well house here. This and start exploring this Horde of the Hunt area that we just, uh, yeah, here you go, that we just took down. And hopefully there's still prismarine shards laying around ready to be slurped up. All right, so it was up here somewhere, right? Yeah, I still have my golems over there fighting, but did the prismarine despawn? I think it did. Man, oh wait, no, it was over here. Yeah, it looks like the Prismarine despawned, unfortunately. I saw the Prismarine just in. This is, yeah, this is where our towers were that I would set up. And I don't see any Prismarine around here anymore. Man, I guess it despawned when I ran away, huh? So that really sucks, because there's a lot of it laying around, and I was already maxed out on it, you know? So, golly. But, as you can see on the bottom right corner, we're at 11 out of 30, so we could have 30 golems on us, which is awesome. And see if anyone needs to be defended right now. Creeper Homestead. Looks like they need to be uh, repaired, but not necessarily defended right now. Oh yeah, what about those towers? Am I able to get anything from those towers right now? I don't know. Oh yeah, let's go around the villages. Let's teleport around, see if any of the villages give us more prismarine. Prismarine, wood, stone, uh, iron, even coal. I'll take anything. Except for diamonds, we're still full on diamonds. This one gave us uh, 25 iron, eh, not bad. But I should definitely, oh yeah, but I have full wood, full stone. So yeah, like I said, let's definitely build them some better defenses. So let's get some gates started on every direction. And there's plenty. Look, look at all the forest around here. We have a huge supply of wood to build all these defenses. So let me get all this built real quick. All right. I think this village is nice and protected at every angle. Yep. Got gates on every corner. And then uh, between them, we got all these arrow towers. And of course, at every gate, we got more arrow towers. And next to the fountain, we got these little uh, scatter towers. So we're going to help them out a little bit more whenever, if any of these defenses do get breached, right? But... Yeah, this village is nice and prepared now, you guys. And let's just go around and gather some more resources so we get maxed out. Because I had to spend a bunch of wood and stone to actually build all this. So let's try and recoup our losses. Anything else is out of the chest after all that? Eh, more stone. That's pretty good. At least we're maxed out on that now, so that's great. And, uh, oh, that village down there is in danger. The piglins will attack this village when the sun sets tonight. Ooh, yeah, so let's definitely go down there. But man, we have this entire horde of the hunt, this last nether portal completely surrounded. So that's amazing. Let's go back to this well house, though. This village though. is at peace for now. Let us hope they avoid the piglins' hungry eyes. Yeah, but the creepers nearby, they got ambushed, didn't they? So let's go check up on them real quick and see if they need any help. Oh man, another chest. Man, there's a lot of these chests just laying around like this. It's inside this one. Any prismarine here? 94 prismarine. Okay, so I wonder if instead of despawning, the Alays actually picked them up and now I have them and now I have 125. Huh. That's interesting to think about because I was complaining about the missing prismarine just a minute ago. That's gotta be what that is, huh? 67% here. If anything, might get one of those. Yeah, Carpenter Hus. Maybe get one of these. Can I even? Oh, here we go. Yeah, maybe uh, try and repair some of those, like, whatever these structures are. <laughs> yeah, I guess I'll place it, like, right here, and at least, hopefully it's going to repair it, right? So what else do I need? Oh, yeah, it's literally just wooden stone to craft one of these. Oh, here we go. Okay, so hopefully I ask you to repair everything there. Oh, and I even have some spawners and some arrow towers over here. I wonder if those arrow towers actually defended them when they got attacked the other night. That's probably what happened. But at the moment, I don't see, like, any creepers just sitting around ready to be recruited here, unfortunately. So, mm, I don't know. Actually, I wonder if they have to be fully repaired up to 100% in order for the creepers to respawn back here. Because we're at 76% now, they're at like 60-something percent a minute ago. And yeah, you know what, let's build another carpenter hut like right here. I can't. Here we go. That'll be good. So hopefully all these like creeper structures get repaired. And yeah, we're at 80% right now. Oh wait, yeah. 
Look at this. We already have creepers spawning in right here. Cool. Let's recruit them. See if any more of them are going to spawn in. Yeah, so it seems like they don't spawn in unless the structure's completely repaired, which these all look like they're because they're not like cracked and whatnot. Yeah, look at that. Creeper just spawned in right there. 87% right now. Amazing. I bet these creepers love that I'm repairing their village here. <laughs> Maybe I'll place down some arrow towers and scatter towers and whatnot just kind of randomly around here too. Especially if they're in range of the uh, carpentry hut, right? Awesome. Let's get some scatter towers in here as well. But it does require coal, which means less creepers I can summon in, right? But at least they're going to be nice and defended if they ever get attacked again.